We got Red Man. Red Don Fiato. Don Red Fiato Man. from nice. Forces. 3.0's winner. He wins with all of his requests tonight. Nine requests in three weeks. We this is Red Man, Ignacio's favorite MC, Don Fiato. Hey, hey, muddy fucking waters mixtape, man. I'm high as a bitch. Muddy waters mixtape. I need a beat. I need a fucking beat. I don't need no turn up beat. I need some elements, some hip hop. Let's get back to some elements and shit. Yeah. Yeah. Josh, I like that, man. You like that, man? Let's turn that shit up, man. Yeah. Lyrical wordplay for y'all. I feel good on this one, man. This is how real MCs do it, you know? Yeah. I like this shit a lot, man. Done for y'all, too. Rome, York, we in the building. Check it out. Yo, when I hit the bong, I'm Godzilla taking over Hong Kong, eating bong tongue with a shotgun and long johns. It's not unsung. No story here to tell. I'm just ready. I'm a student before the school bell to propel my wordplay. Thursday, boy, I bust off three Ks on Martin Luther King birthday. Berkeley College for twenty dollars. If I got it, smoke here and quiet my knowledge. A little psychotic, I know. Rate me, I'm Michael Jordan in the final four, fighting with Wayne Gretzky. I'm not relevant. Let's see who's spitting. Some of y'all Coke and Pepsi. I can't tell the Difference. I'm Daryl when I'm pitching Before the white girl had him twitching Not a rap game in my kitchen Easy pickings Rebel would have calls my mind It's like fuck with mine I put your mind on the wall I'm on tour getting bread And tattoos And your job is giving Tic Tacs and bathrooms I hate gossip I mash up your media mosh pit Release a bad boom in the chat room My weed bag's a vacuum to smuggle Off of one blunt A bitch gon' fuck you Chicks T-Bow the meatloaf When I hit they belly Doc dropping all dimes Rico Take Precautions, I got a Paul Bearer that Bill Coffins for all rappers and nonsense. Nonchalantly, I'm thinking darker than a convict conscious. That's why I'm sweating in the armpits. That's where the bomb is. The gain rate in my city is like the 80s where Kendrick Lamar lived. I got a harvest of purple at my apartment. Across the park, I sell pounds to Cartman. I think like an orphan, I'm in a zone, but it's freestyle, so these words might need a home. Executive neck, I demand respect. Check, don't even talk to me or text the wrong tone, okay? Stay at bay, mm. Man, delay when I write out bull pins from these hand grenades. You could be amazed to hate it, but either way, I get it heated like Kanye and Sway. I'm done with it. I have fun with it. Stay back and tell your girl, come get it. She had Mr. Right, now she want Mr. Wrong. Now she swing along like Serena Arms. <laughs> is, is Kendrick Lamar from New Jersey as well? Or... What was a Kendrick Lamar bar about? He was referencing. Kendrick Lamar's neighborhood. It, but where's LA, Kendrick Lamar in from? In the eighties. LA. From LA. Oh, Compton? Like yes. like where uh okay, yeah, I think I knew yeah. that. I think I knew that. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So and but Red Man's from New Jersey, is he not? Correct. Correct. That's the first place I ever went in the United States. Yeah. Rick City. New Jersey. New Rick Jersey. Yeah. Wow. New Jersey. Right. And we are our, our school is too an, poor. That's an intro to the US, Newark. all right. Our our school is too poor <laughs> to go to uh to go to New York and get a hotel in New York, so they put us up in New Jersey. We had to take the bus in the New York yeah. in the morning to get to where we were going. Okay. But I uh, yeah, New Jersey. That's the best way to do it. Are you kidding me? Actually, well, I guess New I went Jersey. to campgrounds in Maine when I was a kid. That's <laughs> yeah, not true. I was in Maine. I was in I was in New Hampshire. I mean, I guess when I was a kid, we we, we drive through. Camp Gun to Maine stop. probably isn't much different than like most of Canada. So yeah, well, Maine, Maine New Hampshire, <laughs> Iowa, Idaho. I mean, it's like it's out in the middle of nowhere, just out in the park, Washington, so. Washington probably, State, probably a little Canada. Yeah, a little Canada, the north, the north, and and you see it, you see Canada. them more. Those, those most of the Americans that we meet are Northerners of the United States because they're the ones frequently coming over that we see them once a couple months later we see them again we're like hey who the fuck are you we're like well, let's be friends you know and uh, you know that happens a lot <laughs> okay. but um, Red Man I mean dude um, I, I, I kind of got hung up on the Kendrick Lamar bar I was trying to figure out what was going on I was trying to understand that metaphor but um, I mean I, I really I, I don't I don't mean to burst your balloon here Ignacio but I don't think it was red balloons I don't think I was uh, I don't think it was red man's best track I think it was kind of monotonous I, I don't think he was having as much fun as he normally does when he raps when I like him wow. that's just what I, but I'm, I mean it's still a good track don't get me wrong I'm just saying that is my only criticism but um I mean the bar is funny he always gets me laughing he always used to have a couple chuckles during a tune I appreciate that um, nice bars. I'm gonna give it a solid seven point eight. And nice. uh, yeah, what are you saying? What are you saying, Ignacio? 
well, I mean, for me, you know, it's red, man. Um, I think if you watch the video, you obviously will see how much fun he's having in the video when he's spitting these bars. So that's I was watching. Little... I, I was watching. Yeah, the that, video. that's why I'm a little surprised to hear you say he wasn't having. Fun. Okay, All right. I think I, I just think that he was uh, performing. You know, I don't think he, I don't think he, there was zero anger. Okay. I didn't I see any, think, any, any. I don't think this was I a. See, this was more of him just letting people know that he still got bars. Yeah, it's he's not, got bars, and he does. And not, he does. It wasn't something I don't think that he was necessarily trying to be aggressive on. I hear what no, you're I saying. No, I know. And I and, and your opinion is your opinion. I'm still thinking that I still think the man's in my in, in my top five. So that's yeah here nor there. And, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, he's up there for me too. You know what I'm saying? So, but for me, um, this is a nine because I mean, I love I love the saxophone beat behind you know everything in that that yeah, piece. Yeah, that's true. Um, just the way that he matched the the kind of the tone of the saxophone when he first came into the to the to the rhyme scheme. Yeah, match the note you're talking about. Like, Correct. Uh, the, the, actual, note. the actual yeah, the note. note. Yeah. yeah, the note yeah. of the, of the, yeah, blended, of the blended notes. Yeah, that's awesome. Mm-hmm. That was so, classy. Yeah, uh, that, that's a, a good way to bridge in. Yeah, solid nine. Okay, Joe, what are you saying? Um, well, uh, Redman, I, I believe, is one of the most underrated MCs in the game. Mm-hmm. Uh, I think Redman has bars where he's his best. Probably not, not in my opinion. Um, he, he's put out a couple of joints since then that would give this definitely a run for its money. Um I like the fact that it was straight bars, no hook, none of that stuff, you know. Yeah, what I mean? that's true. That's true. Not look at this shiny little object over here, like he brought it straight to you. So um I'm gonna give it a seven point five. Seven point five. I've heard I've heard this track before when it first came out too. So it's, oh, it's yeah. been around so it's pretty, for a while. It's pretty new? Mm-hmm. Like no, it's been around or... for a while. No, no, no. It's it's been around for a while. That's that's why mm-hmm. I'm saying it's not his best work. I think but it came I out twenty fourteen. Seven point five. Oh, that's still, as far as I'm concerned, dude, that's still pretty new. 2014, like, it takes me about 20 years to get caught up on music. I'm still listening (laughs) to shit. I'm still listening to shit from 2003. Like, I'm just getting started. Fuck. We got a long way to go, I I know. I got a long life in hip-hop out of me. Uh, Chuck, Chuck, what can you tell us, Chuck? Uh, I loved it. Um, I did. Um, The, uh, I think I had uh, a rather opposite... uh, um, got a relationship to that track than you did. Um, the, uh, um, I think, yeah, I, I, I enjoyed the beat, uh, his, his flow, his cadence, all, I don't know. The, the whole package was there because even though like a lot of it was lyrical fitness, if you like some of those bars, even though they kind of stood on their own, were saying some shit, you know, mm-hmm. like, uh, the, you know, the, uh, some, some actual things like it, it wasn't kind of cohesively connected so much um the you know, they were kind of stood on their own but uh you know the uh you know there was there was some you know some actual meaning behind some of those and uh yeah it wasn't the, just uh, flexing it wasn't just flexing and I, just, I i loved it um you know that uh that's a not quite a nine for me, um, but close Jesus, to it. I was going to so, say, Chuck um, does not hand out nines too often. <laughs> I don't. I don't. I know. Uh, so we're, uh, yeah. we're going to. takes it gonna, very seriously. It's very yeah, seriously. We're going to go in. We're going to go in 8-8. Eight, eight, um, that eight, eight. Uh, is kind of elevated to my song of the song night. Song of the so night. Song of the All night. Right. Presto, what are you saying, brother? I like the track. Um, it's not my song of the night, but it's up there. Uh, I really like the beat. I can't really say nothing bad about it. Um, yeah, um, 8.5. Steady track, steady 8.5. 8.5 right, is 8. solid, 5. dude. We've been rolling. I'd say our average score of the night is probably between 8.2 and 8.5 tonight. It has been solid yeah. tracks. 